is slightly too fat for the inside dimensions of the of the slide. So I want to cut or mill a, a channel down through both sides. Looking for about five thousandths of an inch. So I'm going back to my uh, highly accurate uh, non-CNC rotor table and uh, see if I can do that. I've got to make some tiny micro adjustments first. I'll do a test cut on these pieces here to see if I'm close to where I need to be. That's about six thousandths of an inch. That's probably Okay, these cuts always make me nervous. Um, in a, a fraction of a second, you can ruin your work all four hours of it. What I'm going to attempt to do is I've, I've got the uh, the depth set perfect uh, for about a two thou clearance on each side for the slide. I don't know if that's tight or not. I have no idea. I've also set the depth, so I'm going to score. This isn't quite square with this, and I want to score ever so slightly where that is uh, not square and then ground that channel out there so we'll see how it works <whistles> yeah that worked and the constant cleanup. continues. I was able to mill a very clean slot on the top there or a channel and score that front part ever so slightly. I have some cleanup to do with the file so I'll bring that down to the file mark but this is where I really it's a little tight but that's fine so the idea is that I want bottom of this slide to actually rest on the bottom of that top of that frame there so I think that, that is a go what do you think